Yo, what is going on everybody? It's Epic here and in today's video we're going over the Morris Aftermarket part which turns it into the blunderbuss in MW3. Let's get right into the attachments. For the first attachment, I had the Jack Wildmouth Barrel, which is the aftermarket part for the Moors. It turns it into the Blunderbuss. This is going to give you ball bearings as well as ADS speed and aim walking speed. For the rear grip, I had the LT Tack Grip, which is going to give it aim walking speed as well as sprint to fire speed. For the Bolt, I had the Quick Bolt, which is going to give you a faster rechambering speed. For the Stock, I had the Verb Tack Stock, which is going to give you aim walking speed, movement speed, as well as hip fire spread. Finally, for the Under Barrel, I had the KS vertical grip, which is going to give you aim walking speed, gun kick control, vertical recoil control, as well as movement speed. Here is my full SMG Renetti setup on the screen. Make sure you guys pause the video if you guys need to here as well as here to get down all the perks. And then here is the full cost up on the screen. If you guys are new, make sure you guys like and subscribe and I will see you guys next video. Peace. All right, today we are using the new aftermarket part for the Moors. Now, I played one game already. And personally, I'll give you my opinion on it. It's not the worst thing we've ever gotten. Let's just say that. It turns a sniper into a shotgun. Hit mark or hip marking. Hip firing is definitely not a go with this gun or with this thing. Good stuff, teammate. The spawns on this map or this new version of Shipman are absolutely diabolical. I literally sat in a corner like that and watched them all spawn. Hit marker. What is it with me playing against all these dad gamers? Like, they're so annoying. They're like, what are you doing? It's like they play it's so weird. He's actually using no stock on that gun. What is wrong with you? No stock is like the worst thing that's ever happened to Call of Duty since the new like gunsmith. Like no stock used to be good, but now it's like completely terrible. You get like horrible re visual recoil control. Yeah, let me strike, Grandpa. No stock really helped you there, buddy. Now, if you do get a hit fire in certain certain times this thing does have your back at some points sometimes it does hit marker and it's absolutely terrible and sometimes it isn't like right there hit marker right to the freaking melon beyond me to understand that i'm gonna put that on the new point oh no 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 I would have killed both of those people. I'm getting lit up. That was a game over moment, man. But hey, we're on the same side. What kind of the range limitations? Nice way to like. Oh my goodness, bro. Why would they change New uh, Newtown? Oh my goodness, too early for that. Why would they change shipment with like the layout? Not a big problem, but still, once this thing goes away, if it does. How am I supposed to get used to the old shipment? All 
I wonder if they're gonna keep this in with the other shipment. It would kind of be a little bit ridiculous. Because two shipments, two rusts. I honestly don't have a problem with the other um, with the other shipment. I, I really like that one a lot, but after time went on, it kind of got a little bit boring. Just because it's always dark. But this one's a little bit of a change of pace just because it's all bright. I really like it. It almost feels like... I personally don't watch anime because I have no interest in it. But it, it kind of looks like... This shipment was like from an anime universe almost. Or Borderlands just because of, you know, the style of it. I have not unlocked the new prestige camo. But I probably will soon. Double kill. This thing's pretty fire. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. As much as I don't want you guys to be using shotguns, just in case I ever run into you. Um, but anyways, this is really good. If you can hit your shots and you figure out where the weak points are, you're going to be dominating lobbies with the shotgun. Dang, not close enough. In my opinion, you really don't. I just saw that dude's um, pass it up on the floor. You really don't need a red dot on the um, Renetti. I personally think it's weird to have a red dot on the Renetti. Even though the iron sight really isn't the best, you really don't need one. I feel like it's a waste of, a, of an attachment. I've been using my same Renetti class setup since the start of the game, or since whenever I made it. Personally, I think it's literally the best class for it. You could, it's literally an SMG. What? That was pretty lucky. Not gonna complain though. 20 off of 100. Oh my god, I'm like aiming with my nose right now. I just, I just wanted to test out my limitations. Yeah, throw your throwing knife in this, Bozo. I can understand Warzone for using throwing knives, but multiplayer, uh-uh. Unless you're doing that like cross maps, and I can respect that. You know, I was on Twitter yesterday. I think I saw the first ever, like, trick shot from BO3, because they're. I'm pretty sure they were using a client or something. But BO3, there was an actual trick shot that looked like it was from bo2 with like all the all the um animations and stuff you know like canceling out reloads all that stuff he had like a he had the search and destroy bomb glitched it out 
did some crazy, crazy, crazy trick shot. I wish trick shots were like that nowadays. Nowadays, like this generation, these kids literally do a 360 no scope. No, like, no cancel swaps, no knacks, no nothing like that. And they just go bonkers, which I, I'm not gonna lie, it pisses me off seeing people that go crazy for like, like, I'll see people go like 360 and then 80s. It's like, how is that even a trick shot? I don't get it nowadays. <laughs> That's like popping someone's tires and expecting it to still drive. Like, no, it's not going to work. Actually, that could have been a really bad. Um... I forgot what those things are called. I, I, if you know, you know. Analogy, that's what it's called. I uh, brain fart. Let me. I'm trying to think of one right now. Oh, heck no. We didn't get these kills up. I need one more kill. Oh, a double kill. Even better. I'm not sure if those Warzone camos work yet, like the challenges. But there we go. 104 kills. If you guys are new, make sure you guys like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.